Assalamu alaikum and welcome back to my channel. It has been quite some time of course that I did not upload any video. I did actually upload the video my, that was actually the old one but I haven't actually shot any videos so today actually I was out on uh, I was actually out because it was Sunday and I had to get some grocery and all that stuff but uh, uh, I ended up being in a nursery and so I picked up some plants that of course I wanted and uh, some very nice ones uh, I'll go through it but I don't know the name of uh, most of them and just for the sake because these are plants house plants and I don't know much about house plants as compared to cacti so I got uh, this one just now I repotted it because it was in the nursery bag and uh, if you guys know the name do let me know down in the comment section and uh, but it's quite pretty it was nice it's healthy and uh, it's pretty nice cool okay this is one of my favorite i mean the moment i saw it it was the only one lying there and it is a money plant or the uh, pothos uh, but uh, I hadn't actually seen one like this with a complete demarcation, you know, I mean like of the variegation Money plant the enjoy the one that's called uh, enjoy But of course that variegation is far more different than this one This is more creamish and you know if I go closer You guys can see it for yourself and it is completely dividing the leaf into two parts and uh, You can see down here. This has a bit of a bit of splash of green over the cream uh, very interesting I didn't touch it it's still in the nursery pot and uh, I'm just waiting for uh, to uh, getting it to acclimatize and then uh, with time definitely okay then after that I have a couple of syngoniums like I have the pink one I have the variegated one I have the another one the green one the typical green one but I didn't know that i can ever get the white one though it is so small he showed me the mother plant that he didn't want it to sell but of course i know this is uh, fine and it is uh, thriving because a new is coming out and i'm happy about it coming to the next one the snake plant i don't know probably this is called the moonlight snake like moonlight or moonshine i don't know uh, and uh, it was at uh, to me it is at a reasonable price when i consider it uh, consider uh, buying it uh, online because for online i have to pay the delivery charges and all that stuff but uh, this one just simply took me over i mean just like i ha i have the typical one the one with the yellow variegation but this one just like you know i mean it's amazing and it's, it's so beautiful it's very i mean like you know i mean like it's it's like it's having that 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 that, that texture that I, I i just love and yeah the next one is also a sensiveria a snake plant the dwarf variety and uh, it's a tiny one but uh, fingers crossed and uh, i hope it will grow because i did purchase some uh, some of these online and they never worked for me so this time I'm not touching it at all let it be as it is and with time gradually after maybe two weeks or three and even currently I'm a bit busy and uh, then after that I'll uh, report them into uh, better containers okay the, uh, then again the, one of the, the, the loveliest and the most prettiest was this uh, ponytail he had many but you know I always like to go deep into it and I searched and I found out this one and this one was the guy was a bit hanky-panky with me because he was showing me the other the plain ones and I have the plain one right outside my home it's a huge one and uh, but uh, this one just took me you know i mean like i just wanted it the moment i saw it it has like a shoot here a shoot here and it has a tiny shoot here and it's just simply beautiful you know i intend to 
let it be as it is for uh, for now and then of course i'm going to change it and i'm going to shift it downstairs keep it indoors uh, inshallah and i'm very happy okay then uh, coming after this is trust me i don't know this but it looked as if it's one of the maranthas or prayer plants you know i mean like um i i i don't know the name of this one but uh, i found it to be something unique in swat which normally I don't, I do not find such thing in Swat, such plants in Swat. You know, in in Swat to find house plants is uh, is is a, a big task. You know, it's, it's a huge task. There are many plants, of course. I won't say, but you know, in Swat, most of them are into fruits and trees, and you know, something that would give them wood in the end. Uh, um, um, you know, for for uh, as fuel purpose, and you know something they can later on use uh, to make furniture out of and things like that but uh, this one was simply so pretty you can just look at it i have to have, of course clean the leaves i have to do a lot it's sunday and it's uh, past noon but it was worth it and just to be on the safe side because here we get our uh, temperatures are a bit uh, low so i already started uh, keeping this so that it gets its humidity i uh, pretty soon i guess i'll have to order for a humidifier just to make it a point that they get the necessary amount of humidity and this one uh, which i would say is the not the king rather the queen because the moment i was getting the plant in the car traveling it's it's not a uh, long distance maybe about five six kilometers from my home but even then within that time it started curling you know so then i realized that yes this is one of the prayer plants or the maranthas or you know something of that variety because this is what i know about them is they tend to curl in order to save their uh, water uh, so i was super excited i go and all of them are at a very reasonable price i mean like if i so I, I would not want to talk about it, but yeah, okay, this was for like 350, this was for 250 Pakistani rupees. I didn't even ask the man exactly what, which one was for, this one, this is the Enjoy, and it's quite a big plant, you know. Uh, this one I got for 800, and uh, the Ponytail Palm and the Sensevieria, this one I know I got for 500. The, this one i don't know i didn't ask the price and for the rest of course i did not ask the price at all uh, but i just kept on buying and telling him to just keep it so and this ponytail palm has mashallah one two three four four shoots two are tiny ones coming and two are big enough uh, to give it that shape you know i just love it uh I don't know. Um, so far, I haven't seen the one that uh, the uh, the one that has the uh, its leaf curved. You know, like the, you know, just like the spider plant. So I have the spider plant, but I haven't seen the one that ha that that curls. You know, the the leaves that just kind of curls like this downwards. You know, and so today it was a lucky day for me, unexpected day. I had not even changed, but I just went to get some grocery and meantime in the meantime rather than getting uh, the grocery of course i did get the grocery but i ended up uh, buying a couple of plants one another thing and the guy gifted uh, me this because this was in a huge pot the, the pot was li literally full full i mean like you know to the max it has no more space he definitely needed to repot them i don't know what it is but i found the foliage because in plants in house plants you know like flowers don't matter to me whereas even in cactus uh, or cacti or any of my plants you know it's the foliage that kind of attracts me rather than the flower so this was beautiful you know the leaves are even wider the full-fledged leaves are even wider and bigger than this one and uh, but he tried his level best to pull out some this is the only one that came out with roots and some ri uh, uh, rhizomes uh, whereas this one and this one are just simply stems but i just put it and let's see 
if it works so i hope you enjoyed my plant haul all of a sudden a new one and uh, pray for my plants pray for me as well but for my plants more so that they survive here in my home and thank you all very much stay tuned for the upcoming videos and i'll see you then take care bye bye